Hi guys, welcome back to Naughty Styles and welcome to Cannes, France. Today we're at Absolute and we're about to show you some world premieres like this one. This is the brand new Absolute 48 Coupe. Let's check it out. I'm so excited about this, you guys, because this is definitely a lot of groundbreaking design that we've seen from Absolute over the years. And we're really excited to show you this one. Well, I'm on the hydraulic swim step, which is optionally hydraulic, right? Yes, it's an optional hydraulic swim step. You can immediately see what's new. Check this out. This is very different. I love this. The thought behind it is when you are inside and you're looking aft, you're able to just have this super open, clear view. Also, when you're sitting and hanging out here in a cockpit, you have this unabstracted views, which is pretty awesome. And these, they've managed to fit in some, check that out. Really cool storage, it goes all the way through. Yeah, it's not watertight, but for like fenders and lines, it's pretty fabulous. Great. Toys, right? Yeah, the new design definitely stands out. It looks very different than the previous Absolutes and especially being a coupe so it doesn't have the flybridge. It gives you a massive entertaining space on the aft portion of the yacht. The swim ladder is right there. Immediately on the port side here is a transom shower. Nice stainless steel. How big do you think this is for tender? You can easily fit a 14-foot tender on here. Wow, yeah, yeah. on the 48. It looks like it. I don't know what the capacity of the yeah. platform is, but, but just size-wise, size -wise, it's yeah. really big. Okay. So we got cap stands on the aft portion, if you're going to go stern in, like we are here right now. Freshwater inlet, power inlets are right there, and the boat even comes with a passerelle. <laughs> At least this nuts. one. Well, Pretty yeah. amazing. Yeah, and here, right here, look. Um, we got the remote here for the hydraulic swim platform and the remote here for the passerelle actually the boarding platform and then look at this cockpit okay can i can i show you guys this because i'm so stoked about this short um this is like the convertible space we're all dreaming about and it's always very difficult with the furniture so what they did here is they didn't do any build-in and this is now for all this new absolutes that are coming out what's cool is all of this furniture could be easily transformed no way yeah so this here actually could also be a, like a low table if you wanted to you can move these together oh you just take the the cushion off too and then you have a cocktail table exactly <laughs> you can move them together you can reconfigure them completely different you can put these on the different sides they all come like all of these how cool is that so everything can be adjusted and changed cool table Rico and I were kind of brainstorming some ideas for a table that could be used in many different ways just a couple of weeks ago. And I think this is actually it because it slides, it could be anchored in, it could be high, low. I mean, I love what, it. what a great table. Yeah. Very unique stern Absolutely. on this boat. Yeah, they did a really great job on the design. And also what's neat about it, look, it's already pre-rigged for enclosure here so you can just Got close it. it up. Oh yeah, I see that here really too. Really nice, which would be a, a pretty awesome feature in California when we get all this, you know, just wet mornings, that everything is wet. So you actually just close it, 100%. leave the furniture out. You're extending, even, you're extending your living space even in the colder month. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And check this out. Ah, nice sunshade. How sweet is that? 
Absolutely Very love nice. it. Push of a button, really nice. Again, something you don't normally get on a 48 footer. Okay. Shall we check out the bow? Sure. Okay, this is also pretty awesome. This is completely open and also look at look look behind you. It's not just going forward that this is completely open. What do you think of the walkway? So it is a, on, a little bit on the narrow side, but I have to keep reminding myself, this is a 48, so it's actually a really good size because this feels like a bigger boat. You I know? totally agree. Okay, let's go forward. Pretty nice layout space here. Mm. Looks like it's a lot of convertible possibilities to it. What's underneath that? Oh, there's like a... That, that probably raises up the way it looks. Actually... And pull. Yep. And Check storage this. underneath. No, there is also a sunshade here. Yep. And the poles are right here to, there. to clip it in. You can like do, you can have put on the bigger yachts. Sun sail over it, yeah. yeah. And then you have the little pop up lights here, which are really cool too in the evening. I think what Absolute is doing really well, they're bringing in a lot of the features from a much larger boat into the smaller boat, make you feel like you are in a much larger yacht. Also good size, you know, great, line great storage, lines. fender storage, all the cover. All right, what's at the bow? Again, pop-up lights even here at the bow. That's unique, I've not, nice. not seen that before. Um, that's, that's definitely kind of cool. Can you imagine when you're hanging out here at night, how nice it looks right. and romantic? And then we have our anchor locker here. It's really Chain. deep. Yeah, pretty, pretty decent access. Emergency winch handle and then our remote control. The way this bow flares out is also pretty cool because it makes it feel a lot bigger. Really wide, mm -hmm. right, the bow? Yeah. And then we have a cool. stainless steel ultra anchor, also really nice, self-upriding, pretty cool anchor and there's with a swivel. And there's small touches that they do really well, like the shaping right here, you know? Yeah. It just, it's so simple, but it just makes your boat last longer. It's just, just great features that you only usually get on the bigger boats. Oh, and. Cup holders. cup holders. Can't have a boat speakers? without cup holders. You miss speakers. Yeah, we got the fusion fusion stereo there, or at least a fusion remote for the bow. And then check this out. There is so much solar on this boat. It is massive. I love where all this technology is going. That everyone is just starting to load up on solar. How great! And hey, let's go Agreed. check let's out go. the interior. What's here? Probably diesel fill. Can you open it for me? Yep. Yay! Big letters diesel. I just saw this here. There's a fresh water hookup right here. Deck wash. Great. And this is our engine access? Yes. I'm gonna check that out after. Yeah. Interior? Yeah, interior. Hey. Wow. Welcome. Come on in. It creates a really spacious entertainment space with a cockpit. It's really like indoor outdoor. Yeah, it is so interactive. You can have guests lounging here on the aft cockpit and prep a little appetizer or make some drinks. Should we uh, open some stuff up? Yes. Got storage. What is this? Oh, oh, dish. <gasps> no. It has a dishwasher. It's a really perfect size for this size of a boat. Look, it's not too small, it's, it's not great. too big. Awesome. Wow. You've got a two burner cooktop. Pool. Storage, storage, storage. Overhead? Yep. What's that? Trash. Oh, nice. Especially yep. convenient on the countertop. Definitely. And then here we have. Oh, look. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, look at these little trash. Cute. So cute. Got a drawer here. That's awesome. Yeah, that's really Really like as well. that, how it's molded in. Such simple touches, but yeah. they really put effort into going an extra step. That's an interesting closure. Mm -hmm. I could say sink. Mm -hmm. Very important. deep. Yeah, important features here. Microwave looks like with a grill option. Yeah. And uh, nothing here. And that's where we've got, look at all this. Oh, I like that. Look how nice that is organized. Ah, oh, they did a great job. Again, it's something you don't really expect from a production boat. Usually it's like semi-custom that you get all this cool extra features. So pretty cool. So here's our 
fridge. Pet fridge freezer or and fridge fridge? Fridge fridge. There are freezer compartments in the fridges. So it actually makes it pretty much like our fridge. Yeah, yeah. A wine cooler mm -hmm. as we keep going forward. I love this. Oh, <gasps> wow. How great. And a really good safe spot for it. Right in the center of the boat. Brilliant. Oh, I like it. Just brilliant. By the way, I really like the plates. You do? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is cool. They're nice. Yeah. No, those Italians. Okay, so get they set. like they like nice china and nice yes. glassware for the pasta. Pasta. Um, anyways, nice settee. Very nice. Wait, you just learned a new word. You just said settee. I'm so proud of you. High low table, mm -hmm. convertible. Great for dinner. Great for drinks. For just hanging out. You can also put a cushion on top. Put your feet up while you're watching a TV. TV. There's no TV. There's TV. There is a TV. Even says absolute on the TV. It does? On the bottom, it did. Really? Right. And if you don't want to watch a TV and you want to really enjoy the outdoors. I'll create a really good cross breeze on this boat. Wow, it's on both sides. Huge! On both sides! You have this window, you have the door, you have this window yeah and the whole back i mean you perfect literally feel like outdoors it's just perfect fast too holy moly really fast yeah. it's raining you're like you're quick can we talk about this amazing it's beautiful with the incorporated solar panels uh, on the older models they would have like a convertible roof right but now we have the solar panels but this is a, a great compromise to be able to have this and then is that um, yeah. manual or no i don't think so it's just a shade yeah so, so if you, can you don't close want it that up. you can just close it up also yeah. keeps the heat out you know when you have the sun out exactly run through the helm rico fantastic okay so helm on the starboard side entire switchboard on the port side nicely covered by this glass beautiful everything labeled properly all your shore power input all your low voltage switches breakers everything is here nice helm chair your starboard door it's pretty exciting actually um, this boat is outfitted with the ips volvo ips drives but not just that it's also outfitted with the brand new volvo dock assist so this boat actually will be capable of docking itself for you of course you have to be around you have to be on standby but technically this boat can dock itself that's in, crazy in a slip with with fingers on each side that's such a crazy concept yeah and then it's all tied in with a brand new raymarine system called dock sense which literally gives you kind of like a sensor setup like you have in a car Pretty but cool does, it, does it like actually shows you sides like it actually would pretty much beeps yeah it has sensors on the aft on the sides so it literally shows you how much space you have um, on, on either side and in the back. But the Raymarine su supplies the sensoring system and that ties in with the Garmin system and the Skyhook kind of. Um, so it knows where the boat is and what the boat is doing, where the bow is, where the aft is of the boat and so on. Pretty cool for, Pretty cool. for someone to get this as their first boat. Yes. And to have all these features. I have not experienced it yet. I have yep. not tried it out yet. I would like to try it out. I um, would like to see how it works. Uh, so I can't give any feedback on that. Concept but, is cool. But if any of you have used that system, please put a little comment in the video underneath. I would like to hear what your experience was. So we have the Volvo Penter display right here for the IPS drives. Chain counter from Quick right there. Battery power switches, windshield wiper controls, bow thruster control, and then our typical switches here at the helm for the navigation lights as well as the bilge pumps. And we have a Raymarine VHF fitted right there. Our shift and throttle controls, Volvo Penta joystick for the IPS drives and the new Raymarine Axiom displays right here. Okay. I want to check out the Master because it's also quite different on this yacht. It is forward. Oh, that's nice and open here. So first, we're gonna go to our starboard side and we're gonna check out this twin cabin. You guys know how we do, masters always last. And, uh, oh, pretty good actually height. This up, remember, it's a 48. Coop. 
great size hanging locker here. Really cool. Yeah, a nice cabin for extra guest overflow. Sweet. What they did here, which is interesting, is they pretty much opt in for a lot of these pocket doors, which creates pretty open space and concept. And on this side, this is our day head slash shared head for these two cabins, for the VIP and the, and the guest. And the guest. And they did do a proper door here. Yes. I'll go in the shower. Oh, Rico, what do you think? Nice shower. I, it could be a two person, but the other person has to be short. <laughs> okay, that now gets really freaky. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, it's a good size shower though, right? Yeah, really good size shower. Okay, yeah. for a shared head. And we have storage wise drawers. Oh, yeah, I like those. Mm -hmm. Drawers and a couple more on the bottom. We're going to check out the VIP, which is on the port side. Wow, that's great. Oh, wow. Really nice size. This could be a master. Again, we're on a 48 foot coupe. Coupe, exactly. It even has a little makeup slash workstation here. It's great for jewelry. Or you can opt in for having a wash and dryer right here. If this is your liveaboard, that's probably what I would do. So you would use this as your guest cabin and you'll have a wash and dryer. Then big, big blinds here on the outboard side, and it looks like there's a pretty good sized window I think behind. we should check it out. Wow. Sweet. Look at that view. I and mean, I, that yeah, could well, be a really yeah. nice view. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it's uh, really low to the water, which is really nice when you're out on the anchor. Also have proper side tables as well. Oh, and right here there's storage too. Yep, small storage, yeah. Again, we're in the VIP. And then, uh, nice. Pre-wired for a TV set. Of your choice. What's behind that door? Behind that door must be a closet. Huh. Wow! That's a walk-in closet? That is crazy. This is really big. You got oh, a lower deck switchboard here as well. Really nice walk-in closet. Unexpected, that's for sure. I'm going to see the master. Pocket door also. And this is a master. Wow. It is different. To have a master of this size in the bow is really cool. There are some trade-offs, right? It might be a little bit louder maybe when you're underway with the water sound, but... No engines, no generator noise. Which is most of the time, if you're really cruising around, you're spending on the anchor, it's pretty nice to have you're this quiet space. Pretty high up, actually. Yeah, the view oh, is the amazing. It's fantastic. It's a, at least a queen size bed. Yeah. For sure. You have your makeup slash work space here. You can sit on the bed. You can also put a little poof here if you really wanted to. Come closer. Uh, here. Oh, this is great size as well. Good Check size. that out. Yeah. And this looks like an emergency escape ladder. Yeah, which it uh, goes. is right there the right emergency there. escape panel you've got a safe in here as well pretty cool again pre-wired for tv check out the head and a pocket door oh check this out this shower goes step down gives you a more lot headroom. more headroom here that's clever that's very tall that's that gotta, is clever that's got to be like two meters and you still have a pothole too yes very nice you can open this up air it out pretty cool really like the designated um, space for the shower soap and, and you know yep. shampoo and so on it's the finishes are really nice I really like it super nice okay and here we have electric head drawers here I <laughs> thought it was open <laughs> um, storage here as well and a little bit more storage also mm -hmm. Very nice. Oh, and the drawers right here. Cool. Do you think they're on both sides? Mm -hmm. Do they? Yeah. Cool. Okay, engine room. All right. Gonna go check this out. Have fun. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, that's roomy. All righty, guys. Welcome to the engine room of the Absolute 48 Coupe. Own and generator mounted midship aft between the two 
hot drives, the IPS drives. Easy access, super easy access actually to service the generator. Uh, this is a really well organized engine room. Really like this one. So we have a domatic chiller here on the port side. One big chiller for the boat. Have a hot water heater there, a C fire fire suppression system, a Victron inverter charger right there, um, switch panels for AC. Got our batteries uh, sitting right there. Two fuel tanks, one on the port, one on the starboard side with the side glass right here. All the plumbing, very organized, very clean. Hydraulic pump for the swim platform and the passerelle. And we have all our solar smart chargers, all Vectron energy on this boat. Little surveillance camera here for the engine room. This vessel is outfitted with Volvo D6. They are the IPS 650s, which have, I believe, 480 horsepower each. Clean engine room, very, very great access. Again, guys, we are on a 48-foot vessel. I mean, this engine room access and engine access for servicing is phenomenal. Super well laid out. Alrighty, you guys, this completes our tour of this Absolute 48 Coupe, brand new model. I hope you enjoyed it. If you are interested in Absolute, all the contact information will be in the description underneath the video. Thank you for hosting us, Absolute. And please like, subscribe, comment, and do all that good stuff. Check out our Patreon page if you're interested in more liveaboard content. Enjoy right. the outtakes. Enjoy the outtakes, Ciao. guys, and uh, comment away. Ciao. Did we have any outtakes? Yes, yes, there were definitely outtakes. Okay. And you can take this upstairs if you wanted to add more furniture up there because it's so easy. It just comes you mean into on the flybridge, which doesn't exist that's on this boat? Yeah, that's really stupid. Okay. <laughs> I'll say you it on can't, the next boat. You can't take this upstairs because there is no upstairs <laughs> on this boat. I'm already Save on, it for the next I'm already boat. On the fly. Okay. It will give information over to. Oh my god, isn't that the boat guy? Yes, it is. God! It is. The, the, the boat show. The boat show. Hi, boat show! <laughs> Sorry. Go. <laughs> Starstruck or what? I was like, wait a minute, I know this guy. Okay, go. I don't know him. Okay. Anyways. Um, did you have a coffee today? And then, I did have a coffee today. It doesn't feel like it. Was it decaf? Maybe. Oh. <gasps> and if you... <laughs> No, it was on purpose like this. Better be safe than sorry while I do this. Enjoy you didn't have outtakes. your coffee this morning. So. Enjoy them. Well, who tipped almost over the vase? <laughs> the wind is picking up. Yeah, it really, it really is Hold on to up. your hats. All right, let's go forward. Yes. That is one of the sensors for the uh, new Raymarine system. New Raymarine system? Yeah. You're going to tell us all about it when we get in? What's it called? Come on. Interesting enclosure. Hold on. What are you talking about? Closure. In Interesting closure, I oh. said. Um, Latch. Latch. Ask me again. <laughs> Ask me again. Okay. I will kill you. Right. Let's go. We don't have time. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. What Ask me again. What do you think of the comfortable walkway? <laughs> Come on, babe. <laughs> Just... <laughs> so first today, first boat, I will uh, kill on, you. Come on, let's go. Come on, go. Why wouldn't I do this instead yeah, of why, you doing it? Why don't you do this? What the heck? Okay, you, you do it. Take my the job away. The closer one to you. Take my job away. Oh. Okay. Okay, are you okay there? Do you need help? Is there a trick to this? Do you need help? <laughs> is this your first time? Alright. Go back. This is, you completely budged this.